Look, man, the Quran is a miracle. I mean, I wouldn't say it is. Is it a miracle to claim that the sun sets in the money pool? Linguistically? Linguistically, it's a miracle. So what, what language is it used that's so magical and brilliant? You know, like, race car spelled backwards, what is it? Race car? There you go, it's called like a padrin. The Quran, using the Arabic text, has multiple examples of this technique, which is like in poetry, modern day poetry, when you study English literature, you look out for these kind of things. When the beginning of a story matches the end of the story, and then it kind of keeps cascading in the middle, Allah says, I know what's going to come after, I know, I know what's going to come before. These kind of things, just by speaking your word, over a 23 year period, you said heaven and hell an equal number of times. You said, uh, you know, there's so many like mathematical beauties in what actual so what, what's mathematic in the Quran? Yeah, it's very it's right. a poetic nature, yeah. 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 Oh, yeah, reference, yeah. Well. So what, what's the mathematical consistency about saying the, mon the, the sun sets in a muddy pool? Pardon? So what's the mathematical consistency about saying the sun sets in a muddy pool? So what's I, consistent I about that? The, that's a, brothers asked a very good question, yeah? And I'll say... My box yeah. a good question, yes. Uh, <laughs> if you know, you know. 80% of the science in the Quran has been proven to be 100% accurate. So the sun sets in the muddy pool then? 20% of the science in the Quran, I'm not sure exactly what you're saying or what verse it is. It's Surah 18. If there's some ambiguity or it's, it's not been proven to be true or disproven to be true, I believe if 80% has been It's been disproven to be, be true. So if you pull out what verse the, you're talking about... What so it's, it's Surah 18, I think it's 87. I don't know, I, I like science, man. Science is one of the Yeah, it's 18 86, sorry. Language of the Quran, it's like the linguistic, like the poetry. I know, I know. Together. No, it's through 1886. I know it's 18 because 1886. it's also very heavily yeah. said, like spoken word. We're here at Speaker's Corner, people are here to hear people speak. Back then, they didn't have TVs. Put yourself in 1400 years ago, Arabia. So, you're yeah. saying it's basically just Shakespeare's poetry then? But anyway, wait, wait. It's, what? God's, it's, God, it's God level. Uh, no, it isn't. Don't, don't try to. There's never any proof that it was not proof that, for example, don't. Muhammad had a revelation of the cave at all. But I want to get to this, yeah, right? You just said you until got and choked and told to You read. told me to go to the verse, and now you're right. saying. But basically, look, until when he reached the setting of the sun, he found it in a spring of murky water. Near it, he found a people. We said, O oh, Zulkarnain. That has authority either to punish them or to treat them with kindness. Uh, so where was the sun uh, set in the money pool? Oh, Zulkanin. Oh, Dulkanin. That's not cool. It's supposed to be Alexander the Great. Don't say it. I don't get what's that to do with the sun. So the, the sun, it says, until we find the reach, reach the setting of the sun, he found it set in a spring of So Dulkane found the sun set in a spring of water. Now I want you to show me where or not if you can see the sun set in a muddy spring. But like, you know when you've got a puddle of water, right here, and the sun was setting, would the reflection of the sun not be in that water? Of course, but whose word is this? This is Allah's word, first of all, so it's his perspective. I don't, I don't really get, like, you're taking away from the Quran's scientific phenomenon when it talks about redshift. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala everything and thereafter. How can a man in a desert know that the, such a terminology as redshift? There was people before him, and he was a caravan robber, but he would have known people's texts, including the biblical text which he stole from. There was Gnostic text before him, literally came in, a man Dude, rose from the dead. I don't know why you're hating And he like, was literally God on earth in spiritual form. We're literally like complementary. I started this conversation, if you remember, let's talk about our similarities that we believe that we I, 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 I did explain to you there's few similarities. For example, yeah. you don't believe that Jesus Christ rose from the dead, but the Bible's very clear that Jesus Christ rose from the dead. I believe you Jesus don't Christ believe, will rise again and he'll come back. To right, earth. but you don't believe, and another thing you don't believe is that you're Jesus Christ was, was I, crucified. I believe he'll come back. I believe he'll come back. You don't believe that Jesus Christ was crucified. I don't know too much about that part. That's that's the gospel, that's the basics of our belief. And maybe you don't believe that Jesus Christ is God. Jesus Christ, if you don't believe, don't, said, if you don't believe I am here, no, you will die in your sins. So this is again a fault of your religion, because not ours. How can a god go to the toilet or need to be suckled or not know? Well, what, what, what do you what do you think God is? What do you think God is? Explain God to me. God is without father or without parent. No, no. Explain God to me. I didn't ask for what he for he's from. I said explain God to me. He's a Rahman a Rahim. So the merciful and most loving. That means nothing. What no, is God? God is merciful right now and he'll be merciful forever. So was he merciful before creation? Yeah. He was merciful before creation. Who was he merciful to? So mercy is the ability not to harm anybody. Who was with Allah before creation? Before there was nothing, there was Allah. And what was Allah? So Allah was Allah everything. merciful to himself? The thing is, yeah. If I say I'm a basketball player, let's say, let, let's say I, let, I'm a basketball player. Okay. Let's say I say I'm a basketball player, right? If I've never p played basketball in my life, yeah. could I say I'm a basketball player? Ready to think? Come on. Two seconds. One second. Come on. Get in there. It's working. It's taking you a long while to answer that question. Yeah. If I say I've never acted in my life, can I say I'm an actor? 
So if I've never acted in my life, can I say I'm an actor? Yeah, this is... Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah. I, I don't know how hot... If I've never been a Muslim, can I say I'm a Muslim? If I never took child out, I was never Muslim, can I say I'm a Muslim? Um, any, anybody with a brain would have answered no, but it seems like, obviously... Is it, I mean, you can't answer basic questions. If I've never had sex, if I've never drove a car, could I say I'm a driver? If I've never had sex, you're could I claim this, I had sex? You're saying this in response to what is God. So you tell me what is God and you then start describing a man. No, no, the reason why I'm describing you're a man, describing a man is, is to show you that you, well, you're, you're God describing himself as a man because merciful, no, he, doesn't. he, he calls himself, himself the most merciful. What does most merciful mean? He this is basic logic. Men are merciful to men. You're loving towards men. Show me an instance where God before creation was loving to somebody. The thing is, before there was nothing, yes. there was still God. So Allah wasn't the most merciful before there was God? I'm saying he still was God. Was he most merciful then? He was. Everything he was then, he is still now. But was he, who did he love before creation? Yeah, you don't understand basic logic. Who did, who did Jesus I mean, I mean this, is, this is... He loved the Father and the Spirit. We, we don't have that problem. See, this is the scientific problem or the, 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 the philosophical problem of the one and the many. So basically, the one and the many. The one and the many I yeah? don't believe in many gods. I believe in one God. You're the one that's making. No, names. I'm saying the one and the many attributes because your God has many attributes, doesn't he? He has 99 names, as you admitted to me earlier on. Right. So if he has 99 attributes, but he can't express them until there's human beings, then you have the problem of the one and the many. The idea that Allah is alone, yet he could only manifest his his abilities when there's human beings, means that he's subservient to his human beings to be able to do anything. Allah doesn't need us. He does need you. No, he doesn't. He does to, no, he to be merciful. He does. No, yeah. no, 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 no. In your belief. In your, no, no. In your belief, he does. Jesus needs human beings to... No, no, you need human beings. So Allah needs human beings Allah to love anybody. Doesn't need us to Allah needs human beings Allah to love. Allah, Allah needs need human like beings to be merciful. Allah doesn't need to like so who did he love before himself. creation then? Who did he love before creation? Who did he, who's he merciful? He so the thing is, yeah, human beings, we need love, innit? God, he don't need love. He so, don't need anyone. So he doesn't need anything. He doesn't need, doesn't need anything. So he wasn't loving to anybody before creation. Allah does not need us. It makes so no he difference. wasn't the most merciful before creation. That means one of his divine names was given to him by us. Do with anything about what God needs. That means like one, one of his divine names was given to him by us. It's not, it's not in need of being merciful. He's just constantly merciful. Yeah, but that's the name he's been given, correct? He gave it to himself. He gave it to himself? Yeah. At what point did he give it to himself? 99 non yeah, You see how you're, you're burying yourself right now? Say again? All the 99 names are... Oh, no, that wasn't my question. I said, uh, what, you said that he gave it, the names to yeah. himself. And through the, At what point did he give himself... Out? Yeah, how do we find out? So the Loi Quran, the Quran's been written before we... No, no, I didn't answer that question. I asked you, said to me that Allah gave his names to himself. Yeah. So I know that I asked you, names, how does he know he gave them? These names are in the Quran, and this Quran has been here right. since the beginning of time. That word that you guys believe Since the beginning of time? That word that Okay, that's another problem. But the, the, the main problem the I have... Word, the bro, word that you believe in, that is if, there if, is God and there If is Allah is Ar-Rahman, Ar-Rahman, him, right? And he doesn't express yeah, our heart, right? Right? I mean, when I say the book, then yeah, he cannot be most loving and most merciful for creation. When I speak about the book, yeah, the word, yeah. So work it out, man. The book, the book is the book created. Allah told the pen to write. It's a pen. So there, there was a floating pen. Yeah, there was a pen. Is the pen eternal? Is it, it wrote an eternal book? Oh, so the, the book is eternal. The book is eternal. Do you know what eternal means? Without beginning or end, that means you have two gods. You have the pen, the book, and yeah, Allah. So it's the pen, it's, it's God and the Word of God. It's the same similarity, my friend. So the, 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 the pen is the same as the book. I mean, are you hearing yourself? The pen wrote the book. So the pen wrote the book. The book is eternal. But it's God that gave the command for the pen to write. Right, but the book is eternal. So that means without. So remember what eternal means. Eternal means without beginning or end. Right, he claimed that Allah had a book up with him that a pen wrote but on. Even you guys believe in there was God and then the Word. Yeah, but we believe that Word is Jesus God. and Jesus yeah, is eternal. It's God and then like God and the Word. It's not like yeah, there has to be a chicken and an egg. So there was God first. We can both a chicken and an egg. We're, we're talking about God, not a chicken and an egg. So, uh, pay okay. attention. Yeah, right. No, but what you're saying is you're going right circular argument. Sorry, it's so. not a circular argument. Right. We believe that Jesus Christ is God by nature. You don't believe what that. The, first, do you God, believe the Quran is? What came first, God or Jesus? But both didn't come first. They're eternal. Huh? Both didn't come first. They're eternal. Right. I wasn't strong at all. I answered your question. So they're both eternal. Do you even know basic English? I know. I know. I do actually. Yeah. It's funny. I'll be honest. Because I think you do. My, my English language ain't great, man. That's fair enough. But basically, look, if you're going to claim that there was an eternal book, that that book has to have no beginning or ends. 
Allah in your worldview has no beginning or end. And I want intelligent Muslims to ask this question, but Allah has no beginning okay. or end, and you believe a book has no beginning or end, that posits two things that have no beginning or end. Now, what do we call two things that have no beginning or end? They're both eternal. And they're both God, because only God can be eternal so, so beginning there's, or end. There's God and God's word. For us, God's word is the Quran, and for you, God's word is Jesus. Yeah. So then, so then you, you, don't, you shouldn't really have a problem with the Trinity then, because you have a Trinity yourself. No, but we don't have a Trinity. You do. Have... You do. No, you've got, you've got God and mentioned. His Word. You, you just you look, I, I listen. Look, I, look, I don't have to waste time here because I've, you've already proved my point. But you just admitted on camera that God has a Word, yeah, and then God and, in the one God, yeah. and that is it's Allah the Quran. It's Allah the Quran. No, well, no. So Allah, yeah. Allah is the Quran in terms of like that is, well, how is God in the Word? How you believe it's God in Jesus? We believe it's God in the Quran. Wow! Did you say Allah's the Quran? The Quran is the Word of God. Do you believe that the Quran came to Earth? Did it? Did it? For example, the Quran. You say that the Quran is like the word of God? I don't know about that. You're, you're committing major you shirk here. Just keep going, man. I've got the cameras. Look. Major shirk you're committing right now. You're, you're associating partners with a lot. Let's do this. One of the Kabila Bunaz is right. You're talking about something which you're vague on. Yeah. Right, so you've got to be careful, I think. Right. I would say you look, you're, you're not intellectually able to have this to it. You, be, you may believe that, but if you believe it's the word of God. I don't believe a human was able to create Well, actually, you've said to me that you actually believe that the Quran is next to God and it's eternal so but you've already agreed with a trinity it's the word of God isn't it? yeah and it's next to God isn't it next to God yeah <laughs> so who wrote on the book who wrote on the book was I it a pep I think it's confusing himself God, God no. is God isn't it I think you're looking too much into it God, God no. then made you're his decree the line too much nah. God if made I, his decree I, I mean it's, it's, it's basic something. English if I say that I, there's, if I say there's one it. thing without no beginning or end and then i say there's another thing without no beginning or end and puts it in two things without beginning or end now people online will understand this completely because it makes sense you can't because you for some reason like, what you do yeah. is you're trying to read yeah. but basically to, like, i don't really need to read into it it's basic if i claim there's two things that are eternal yeah. i'm claiming there's two gods but anyway we're done here look it was a nice conversation I but like i think we're done here that jesus and god the argument you're trying to disprove me with and like cuss me out for uh, I didn't cost you at all. Yeah, no, he's done well today to be fair. What is that? Yeah, I watched it. It's John, isn't it? Hmm? Is it John? Yeah. Yeah, I thought it was. Yeah, man. Uh, it's, it's, all, it's all good in the hood, but you don't know your own religion, I just unfortunately. Feel like you're saying the same thing about Jesus and God. Like yeah, because Jesus is God and we believe in a trinity. You, you have a trinity, you just don't want to admit. My trinity doesn't take away from the oneness of God, and there is no trinity. So you believe in a trinity? You just said my trinity doesn't take away from them. Are you hearing yourself right now? Alright, hear me out. If I was to say three, I'd say there's God, and then there's the Quran, and there's from Muhammad, peace be upon him, who's the walking, talking Quran. Bro! Hey, what? Okay, all kinds of shirt today. Did you just hear that? Muhammad is the walking, talking Quran. You said the Quran is the word of, word of God. So Muhammad is the word of God according to this guy. These guys are not hearing themselves, dude. Oh my, hey, uh, we're done. We're done. Is God word everlasting? No, he would have made that. He would have made it. He would have made it. Is the word of God everlasting? Yes, he is. It's, it's love. It's love. It's love. Yeah, it's love. Yeah, it's love. 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 It's the people in uh, Syria, the people in uh, Turkey, did they read the same and interpret the same Quran as um, as God to you? There's only one Quran. No. You go and All right. pick up any Quran. Let me ask you a question. Hasn't been changed. Let me ask you a it will question. Be the same everywhere. There's only one Quran. Yes, the Lohe Quran, the one that's. Oh, hold up, there's hold only up. one. Proper, there's only one Quran. There's only one proper Quran. Yes. Okay. There's one Quran. In the, in is the Quran in the form of a book or is the Quran in the form of recitation? There is. Is the Quran in a book form or is the Quran in a recitation? Lohe Quran. You're in problem yeah. because he said recite, yeah? Read. But when you read, oh! Read. So, if you read, you need something to read. Yeah. How did Muhammad know to read? There is up in the heavens the Lohe Quran which is a Quran that's been preserved in the heavens. And that is what he was. You sure about that? Yes. Hold up. You sure about that? There is a Quran. You have your phone? Yeah. Open your phone. All right. Read Surah 41, verse 9 to 12 first. 
to the 30. So to the 41. Chapter 41. Which one? 41. Yeah, verse 9 to 12. Read that first. Verse what? 9 to 12. Surah 41. You, have your, you want to date it too? Surah 41, 9 to 12. No, you can write it down. Read out, please. Say, O oh, believers, indeed Allah created the earth in two days. Yes? Read up. 41, verse 9. Ask them, O Prophet, how can you disbelieve in the one who created the earth in two days? So Allah created the earth in two? Two days, yes? Hold me up, wait. Carry on. And how can you set up equals of him? That is the Lord of all the worlds. Mm -hmm. Carry on. He placed on the earth fair mountain, standing high, showering his blessing upon it, and ordained all its means of sustenance. And this was four so days, four right? Four days, exactly. Oh, okay. For all he was. Okay, carry on. Then he turned towards the heaven when it Hold was... up. So Allah created the earth before him turned to the heavens, yeah? Huh? Allah created the earth before him turned to the heaven, yes? Then... Allah yes, yes. created... So Allah created the earth before him turned to the heavens. He put the mountains on earth. So Allah created the earth before him created the heavens, yeah? No, 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 no. How can you turn to something if it doesn't exist? Hold up. Well, so you have to turn to the heavens, right? Bro, to exist it, right? He's looking here and yes. he made earth. Yes. Now he's looking back at the heavens. To create heaven. No, read verse 12. Read verse 12. I think he's looking back. He's at creating the seven heavens. He didn't say that. Here we are. Then he turned towards the heaven, but it was still like smoke. Yes, and he created but the seven like heavens. Like Come willingly. I will not. All right. They both submitted. That's 11. That's 11. Go to verse 12 now. So he formed the heaven into seven heavens. In so he formed, when he turns and he turns, it formed the seventh heavens. It was, it was smoky. And oh, then look. Okay, so yeah. the earth was created before the seventh heaven. Yes. Okay. So he formed the heaven okay. into seven heavens. Go to Surah days. 2, verse 29. To yes, 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 yes. yes. And we, 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 we get the that. Lowest now. Heaven with we get like that. We get that. We get that. We get that. Go to Surah 2, verse 29. That is the design of the Almighty. So Allah created the earth before him created the heaven. And that is Allah says that. Yeah. Go to 2, verse 29. Let's confirm if Allah created the earth before the heaven. Before Mr. Mwamuase. Okay. 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 A Quran where it is. 2 verse 29. Verse 2, chapter 29. Chapter 2, verse 29. Indeed, Allah created the earth, right? And then He turns to the heaven, yeah? That's in a smokeless, that's in a smoky state. Yeah. It's a smoky state, so the earth created before the heaven, that's so, all. 229, it is he who created for you all that is on the earth and then turned above and fashioned it. So him create everything that's on the earth, then in turn towards the heaven and fashion it, yes? Yeah. Now read Surah 79. Surah 79. How come he doesn't know of this by now? Hold up. Read Surah 79. Read, read Surah 79. Listen, Surah 79. Verse 27 to 33. Because Allah, here is Allah, here is, here is Allah making a mistake. Is that I create the earth first or I create the heavens? He can't create the two of them one time. I know me says your Quran. Eh, eh. This is the Quran. Your Quran says that. 79, 27 to 33. Listen, 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 listen. Listen. Hey, listen. Listen, listen, we don't want to hear that. Read your Quran. I'm different, bro. You just realize this contradiction because Allah created heaven before he created earth. Here we go. Bro. No, 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 no. Read verse. No, try to change it. No, we take out Quran on you. If you try life, we take out Quran on you. I'm not a rough up. I have seven different Quran here. Which one you want to read? Huh? Which one you want to read? Can me dangerous like that? Alright, 79, 27. Yes. I'm not, listen, I'm not disagreeing with anything know, you said so You're a good boy, man. You're good. You're good. I'm not a problem with you, though. 27. Which is harder to create, you or the sky? Right, hold up. He built it. He never said that in the Quran. Uh, which is harder to create, you or the heavens? 79, 27. Or the sky? Right, the sky means heavens, right? The sky. He Heaven. built it. Right. Raising it high and forming it flawlessly. Yes. He dimmed its night and brought forth its daylight. Yes. Brought its daylight. Yes. As for the earth, he spread it out as well. As for the earth, so the heaven up there so build before earth, but earth over there so build before heaven. Contradiction, my friend. Contradiction. I don't understand what you're saying. Oh, read it again. I don't understand how Okay, let me make you read it. Look, look. Watch this. Let which me is harder to create, you or the sky? No, it, it, never, it never says sky door. It says which is harder to make, heaven. You see it? Raising Different. it high and all up. forming it. You see me, me not read them the kind of Quran. Me have he all, did its night look, and me brought lose. forth its daylight. Me like have all interpretation. Yeah, now watch this. I want you to read something to him, yeah? In Arabic. No, 79, 27. Yeah. What were you debating? 
No, I show him something, but he might go and like that live. I tell him. 79 27. Read. Listen. Are you a more difficult creation or is the heaven Allah constructed? Did, what did you just read to me? That is wrong. It says, which that, is hard to Not the sky, you. the sky is not a heaven, brother. The sky is the heaven. No. No, because Allah is above his heavens. The sky, sky is the lowest. You're in heaven now. The, you, the earth, the earth is in the atmosphere. I'm not in the so sky. what are you okay. guys trying to compare? I'm no, no, I'm, I'm showing him something. He's trying to say that Allah says that first. What are you trying to say? Okay. What watch, is your contradiction? Watch this, watch this. What is this. the great contradiction? Watch, let me show you. Let me show you if you don't see it. What is the contradiction? Hold up now, hold up now. 29. What? It is he who created for you all that which is in the earth. Then he turn and direct himself to create the seventh heaven. So Allah create the earth before I create the heaven. Which one? So if him create the earth, why Surah, why Surah, why Surah 79, 27 contradict it? Contradict it because he says Allah create the earth first. No, when you read Surah 79, he says Allah create the heavens before the earth. Then he spread the earth. So that's contradiction, my friend. That's contradiction. Brother, if Allah say him create, listen. If Allah say him create the earth first. I see it. He can't go back in a different part, go say him create well, the heaven. said um, 229 and 79. No, 220, 279. No, but the one that you 229, read 229. 229 yes. and then 79, 27. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Just read, man. So many Tafsir scholars mentioned that the earth was created. You can't first. use no Tafsir yesterday, no. Quran near talk about. No Quran, no Tafsir to this. Because if you use Tafsir, yeah. I'm going to get you busted with the Tafsir. Because no, you may, if you open up the Tafsir, I'm going to go where Muhammad is an idol worshipper. Go on, show me. No, don't open up the Tafsir, open up your Quran. Yeah, hold on, hold on. We don't accept no Tafsir around here. Hold up your Quran. Open up your Quran because Tafsir, when you use it, them say it's not authentic. When you use the Hadith, it's not authentic. I'm not interested in that. I want the Quran that is authentic. No, you don't have to ask me nothing. We are talking already. The smoke. The smoke. The smoke that he turned to mm -hmm. before he manifested yeah. the seven heavens. Yes. That smoke. Yes, sir. Before there was nothing, there was Allah. Is it, is it seven heaven? Can you prove there's seven heaven up there? The heavens, Can you prove there's seven heaven up there? So I lie again, because there's no seven heaven. Muhammad said he went to the seven heaven, yeah? Oh yeah, true. Then Muhammad said he went to the forest mosque. At the time when Muhammad went to the mosque in the Middle East, which is in Israel, Alaska mosque, was there any mosque there? Alaska? No, it wasn't. Alaska mosque created eighth century. But then you got the Wailing Wall. The Wailing Wall was a synagogue of the children of Israel. Yeah, it was destroyed when it was destroyed when Rome and in the 70 AD. Uh, Israel destroyed 70 AD. When when Babylon destroyed that. So again, this guy, listen to him. He knows a lot, but he doesn't know much. Brother, listen, there's no harm in you taking up the Quran and read it. Read the Quran, brother. It's very important. You see, if you read what Muhammad said, you don't realize Muhammad is a lot more close to Christian than anybody else. Bro, I agree with you. I agree with you. You're a good youth. Judaism, Islam. It's all I based wish. off of the foundation of believing. I was actually God. willing to ask you, like, what do you believe in? Oh, I'm an Israelite. I only believe Hebrew in Hebrew Israelite. No, I'm not an Israelite. Just Israelite. What's the difference? Hebrew Israelite, there's no such thing. What about the ones in America? Them? them I follow a religion of man created by them. I in thought you're the same thing as them, no. man. No. See me? Mm. They don't believe in the Immaculate Birth of Christ, you know. And you're a Muslim and you believe that. Yeah. So they're pagans. They're Kufa. You know, response them and my brother. But I have to choose to go to paradise. Not choose to go to hell. So if you're my brother and you want to take me to hell, me I go brush off my shoes and me I go run left you. Yeah? So it's not about whether you're a Hebrew Israelite or not. It's about keeping God's commandment, laws and stuff. Yeah. The, the disciple them ask Jesus, Great master, great rabbi. How can we be saved? Yeah. Christ says, keep the commandments, the laws. The commandments are laws. Keep the commandments yeah. and the laws. It's not grievous to man. Now, when you go to religion, they don't keep the, When you go to Christianity, they don't keep the laws. You know? When you go to Christianity, they don't keep the commandments. God give you a commandment, we must keep Sabbath, right? Sabbath, yeah. Why we worship Sunday? Sunday. 
Friday. You know we don't follow religion on a Sunday, right? But it's, uh, we do Juma on Friday. Juma, at least we can say your Juma can fall into Sabbath, right? Because sundown to sundown, sundown Friday night to sundown Sabbath, right? Juma starts Thursday night. There you go. But if you look at the time when Christ was crucified, he was crucified Thursday morning and take down Friday, right? So you have to look upon Christ as certain things. It's the same. Like we believe in the oneness of God. Like, no, no problem with your belief. Let me explain to you. I don't have no problem with that Muslim belief. Yeah. I don't we just don't follow religion. Make sense? As I used to like, we're commanded to follow God only. We can't go to no religion unless we sin against God. Yes. And we can prove it from all the Prove it to me next week. I'm going to be going. No, no, we can't tell you. You can read it when you go home. Proverbs, the book of Solomon called P.R.O. After Psalms, it's called Proverbs 30, verse 4. He ascended. Who is God's son? And who is God in the same verse? Oh, yeah, so who is the Father and who is the Son? Yes. But it's not Trinity because guess what? Let me explain this. To, let me explain this to you. As a man, right? You have life. So God is in you. The Spirit of life is in you. That's God. Because He's the only He's the only man we can give life. God that gives me life. God that gives me ability to speak. There you go, brother. So when Jesus Christ came on earth, right? Was He God or was He man? Man. So God was in the he was. God was in the man of like God was equally as if well, God was in the man just like you and me. Yeah. But the difference between Christ, he didn't have a physical father like me and you. Yeah. Me and you come from physical man and you know say the sons of Adam are sin, right? Yeah. So if all sons of Adam sin and Christ never sin. Christ never sin, you know. The Quran says Christ is our holy holy son, you know that. The Quran 1919. He is a miracle, isn't he? Yes, brother. Well miracle. said. If he's a miracle, then he can't sin because he's from God. But my like, prophets are, are, sin, are flawless. Hold up. You know in your Quran, Surah 4, 171, yeah? It says he's a messenger, he's the word, and he's a spirit that proceeded. You believe that? No, no, no. You never know that. Go in your Quran uh, see if you believe this. This is the only one I'm doing because he's got to go. Surah 1471. See this D, look. Surah what? 1471. That, what, that's only oh, 4171. Four, four, Surah 4 verse 171. Yes. One, and did you know that this is the only place in the Quran where you mention Trinity? People of the book, do not exceed the limits of your religion. Yes. And attribute to Allah nothing except the truth. Yes. The Messiah Jesus, is son a messenger, of Mary, messenger? Was, a yeah, messenger? The Messiah Jesus, son of Mary, was only a messenger of Allah. And a word? And his command. His word? That he conveyed to Mary and a spirit from him. His word? To his word? And is spirit proceeding from it. Let me show you this. No. That's incorrect. See like, Pillar is adding. No, no, no. Oh, let me show you which Quran to read. <laughs> you need to read the original Quran. It's me Arabic. Have, Arabic me have, me have all, yeah, man, me have bring, all. Bring me the Arabic. I'll me have Arabic. all Quran. Bring me the Arabic. Nice one. So, can you, me know you can read Quran, yeah? Yeah, yeah so I read Arabic. All right. Is it this one, four, seven, one? Yes. yes. All right. Oh, no, no, no. No, give me the Get read. Meaning, yeah. Yes, brother. Close up that hand so you can read Thank it. Thank you. Ya kitabu la ta ta qilu fi dinakum wa la taqulu ala Allah illa al haqq inna ma al masih Isa ibn Maryam Rasulullah wa kalimatuhu qalaha illa Maryam wa ruhun minhu. Ah. So that's what he's trying to say. He's trying to use the ruhun minhu line. All right, look. Look. Mm. No. Give me the tafsir of no. the No, I know tafsir you need. Yeah. You just Which need to, to just read, just read what it says, man. Okay. We're not here to lie. We're just gonna read. Mm. Quran, we read, right? Oh, people of the scripture, do mm. not commit excess in your religion or say about Allah except the truth. The Messiah, Jesus, son of Maryam, was but a messenger of Allah. And his word, words and a spirit proceeding from him, yeah. And his word, which he directed to Mary, and yeah. a soul created. A soul means spirit, right? Yes, uh, yes. So you yeah, have a soul, a spirit, and a messenger from Christ. Yeah, no, yeah, Jesus. But, but where does it say that uh, he is Ibn Allah? Because here it just says he, it's like it's a miracle that he came from ah, Allah. But where's, where's the son bit? Alright, uh, read this one. Use Yusuf Ali, but like, give me, give, use Yusuf Ali. No, these, these are the seven interpreters for your Quran in, in the last hundred years. Yes. Yes. Man. Yeah. That's why we give the look. It's, I, know we, the, I, Quran. I, I agree, I agree that it's God's you're good, power man. that you're let him have be born. But you're good, you're good. There's no, you're good. There's you're no notice, to say that he's a son. Notice me and your reason. Not like my youth, right? He's no. trying to get at you, right? It's not about getting at you, it's just getting to the truth. That's the most important. Not getting to get you angry, not getting to the truth. So we don't teach that. Which one's your youth? The black guy. Uh, David. Yeah. He's your son? No, no. Yeah. He's, 
This is Abdullah Yusuf Ali, yeah? This guy. Yeah. But then he says that... You see, say, my good man, yeah? So he, you can't follow them. He says that Jesus is God, though. He can't say that. It's That's up to him. It's up to him. It's not up to you. It's up to him. Never you judge them. You just follow the laws, the commandments, and the statute where you're Brother, I'll yes, see you next week, inshallah. Yo, do me a favor when you come. Bring a 8 gigabyte stick for me. I got I so have all my can, history. I so we can, if we can take a stick and bring you home and the following Sunday, we can bring you back to you. Inshallah. Because we want you to learn something after. You see, Trinity? Uh. In time they come to debate you, you can destroy it. I want, I want to think, I you want can to debate you on Africa. 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 About no, Africa, when it comes you know, to Africa, yeah? Yeah. When it comes to Africa, right? Yeah, talk to me. Me been to Africa, you know? No. Why we speak of Africa? We speak of Africa because today we know it as Africa. But before it wasn't called Africa. It was also called Abyssinia. You're supposed to know this. No, Abyssinia was um, South. No, no. Abyssinia once was called the whole Africa because the rule at the time was Ethiopia. So every time a nation ruled in Africa, the continent was named after them in the olden days. I can tell, I can tell, look, for example, my region of Africa, I'm North Africa. I can give you from before. You look Jesus. like you come up from up Zamalia side, around them side. No, I'm North Africa. In Algeria, you got dark skin. Oh, you're Algerian? I'm Algerian. So you're Algerian. really an Israelite then? Who be, yes, you're a, you're a mix, 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 black, you're, you're, you're a mixed race. Yeah, my mom's uh, Arab and my dad's uh, a black Arab. man. He's dark. Yeah, a black man. Yeah. He's a Israelite. He's a Nubian, actually. No, no, not, no, he's not from that side. He's oh, from the okay. other side. He's from uh, East, not East. He's, no, he's Zenetic. Oh, Zenetic. Yeah. So, you're saying that Al Kabulan. Mm -hmm. I've, I've done research on Al Kabulan. Mm -hmm. I'll make it quick because I've got to go on Al Kabulan, I've never seen it in any historical text. Mm -hmm. And I've seen it, all I've seen it being used by is, I don't know if you've heard of the FBA movement. Yes. 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 That's the only people I've seen it being used by. And it's been used by. Um, History revisionist. All right. With me, I can like the root of the word Africa it comes mm. from Africa proconsularis, mm. which is the Roman province in the north from. What, did, what did you say? The Rome. Let, 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 let me get to it. 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 I love this guy. Let me get to it. Let me get to it. I'll tell you. I'll tell you where they got theirs from. Now I don't know how much you know about Berber culture. Yeah, man. So they had a, before Islam, they had a goddess called Afri. Now there's one root, they say they got it from Afri, that goddess, or they got it from the word Ifri, which means cave in Emesir, which is the language of my people, isn't it? That's where you go from Ifri, Africa. Or if you go with the Berber goddess one, Afri, you get to Africa. Lovely. Exactly. Now explain this, yeah? Very simple. Mm -hmm. Afri, yeah? Yeah. No problem. What is the color of the uh, Ethiopians? Black, right? Ethiopian is black. So what is the color? of the Egyptian. Egyptian is tan. Egyptian became tan when the um, Ottoman Empire take over. No, 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 this is false. This is false. I'll tell you why. All up, all up, all up, Aki, 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 all up. All up, Aki. All up, Aki. All up. Let me tell you something, Aki. Tell me. In 1450, what happened to me and your people? 1450. My people were still, we were... Zienis. Right, your people in 1450, right? Uh. Was in Spain and Portugal with us. No, no, that's North and South. No, no, wait, 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 uh. wait, wait. Uh -huh. When did you, when the Jews, the Moors, and the Muslim got expelled from Spain? Yes. We signed to a king in Portugal named King John II. Yes, I know this. Yes. Right. It was the Reconquista when they expelled everyone. So why are you talking like so you don't know the thing? You don't. You miss somebody new. You miss out so many notes. No, but you're talking, what? I'm no, talking no, about no, Africa. No, no, you're no. bringing me we the bring, Reconquista. We have, we, no, we have, bring, we have to talk about Africa because uh -huh. as African, right, mm -hmm. we control uh, Portugal and Spain. Why we control? Because we already conquered the Moors. They conquered. It wasn't the Muslims, it was the Moors. Yeah, I know. North Africa, Algeria, Morocco, Tunis, we conquered it. Yeah, I know that. So why can't I find more Muslims like Kenya? So we raise them. Me love to talk about this more than talk about religion. Yeah, you know? I love history. I don't want to talk about Me rather talk about this, you know, come here, you can't argue upon this. Yeah. I only recently history? found out that Algeria, Morocco, Portugal and Spain all used to be ruled by one. I only recently found Listen. out. Even know the African used to rule Spain and Portugal. I feel we learn. Every rich is there is for black people. That's it. That's Which it. the only country never Ethiopia. been conquered? Ethiopia. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And where can you find the holiest church? Ethiopia, no? And where can you find, you know, in the Psalms? No. There's a word called H E W N. You hear that word, right? The UN. Where can you find the seven UN? Ethiopia. Church in the, in the mountain, right? You have to climb up and go through the rock, right? I have to go down here. So, 
if it's in Ethiopia, where did God choose him people him from? You is a person of God, man. Him is a person of God. But no, my, my Do you know that your spirit mm. that's in you? Choose some up there before you take your body. Yeah, I don't know. That we believe so, that. Jesus' name was before the body. Sorry, what was that? Jesus' spirit, his name came before the body. It came. You know that the Bible speaks. Before speaker, our body, yeah, before our bodies so are. So that's why Christians get confused with the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost because they don't realize that everything about righteous man was prepared from heaven before it reached. So it's too easy, man. It's too easy. That's why we don't argue over religion, brother. Let's reason with religion. Because, you see, if you read the Bible and read the Quran, you'd be surprised. Surah 931, where it says, They have taken their lords and monks as what? Lords, right? Apart from Allah and also the Messiah. I didn't say that. Your Quran says that. So what does it mean? Speaking of the children of Israel, right? So, don't say Trinity, right? But Trinity right in your Quran. The word Trinity mentioned in your Quran. The word Trinity is not in my Bible. The word, ask him, the word Trinity, you cannot find it in the Bible. What Bible do you follow? Which one? Uh, Same KJV, just like them. The concept of Trinity is in the Bible. The concept, the theology is in there. But the word you cannot find. But funny enough, the word Trinity you can't find in the Quran. <laughs> okay, I think it's the it goes against it. It talks about it. It's a, ah, the, so, it in your Quran, it's mentioned the word Trinity. It's it, negating it. Yes, it's obligating it, right? It's no, re negating. refuting it, yeah, refuting yeah. it. Yeah. So, it's in your book, but Good, in, in my I book, got, it's not I there. Got, that's <laughs> you can't find I it there. Palms. You cannot find it in there.